Hello everyone, welcome again and today I will show you another demo of uh, Java Spring Boot project which is on grading system. Uh, it's kind of application, web application that manage the loan application and uh, uh, loan process uh, over the uh, like uh, in the banking system or in organization that are providing loan. So currently server is off, this why showing this error. So I'm going to flip my uh, ID as ID we are using STS tool here. Now as you can see my server is running already so I just stop the server and I will run the project from the first uh, like from the scratch. Before run the code let's talk about the technology that we are using in this project for the front end side it's using JPA, JSP, HTML, CSS and Bootstrap and for the server for the back end side it's using Spring Boot and hibernate to manage the database thing it's using mysql and the data is there over the mysql workbench under the database we have a different different tables like apply, apply loan table is there assign background verification assign loan verification feedback help upgrade verifications status user and user feedback so here is a user feedback so this will be all the end to end users of the application that are going to be interact with uh, the functionalities we have admin user we have a users and user means customer we have a loan officers we have a uh, field officer so now again flip to the eclipse and check uh, and, and let's run the project and check the end to end functionality how the things are working over there so uh, if you are watching if you are watching this as a for the demo purpose and if uh, and if you had already uh, configured that project at your machine, just follow the steps, the same steps to run the project, right click on the application uh, file that uh, go to run is, select the Spring Boot app and after uh, some time you will see this console log and you can check the port number and which port number that project is running. So why I am showing you these things because uh, if you buy the project from uh, Code 1 and if you take services from um, Code 1 team will be available to set up and run the project at your machine. So we will uh, give you project in this condition at your machine. So easily after that uh, you can follow this demo to understand the flow of the application. Okay. So now if you see uh, the server is started and uh, it's running on the port number 8080. Um, now just open the resources folder under the open resources folder application or property file and just copy the project name as slash loan grading and remember the port number 8080 now okay go to your browser just enter localhost and the project name that you have copied from the configuration file so this will be your home page under the home page we have different options like home is there about us contact us these are some static pages and sign in option we'll see uh, more in detail user sign up user sign up means uh, as a customer if you want to sign up into the application you just hit the um, fill all these details click on the save uh, button and you will register as a new user so after this, if you refresh the user table, you will definitely get the um, store the data there. So if you notice, we have a double L in name and we enter this name in our user table. Let's check the record number fifth with the name LLA, which is there. Okay. Another option for the sign up, we have a big, uh, like user also can sign up as a loan officer or a field officer. So we have to just differentiate the name from here and so just enter the first name last name user id let's say one two three the password confirm the password so all these fields are using validation so make sure you are entering the valid data valid data over there select the gender contact number date of birth like let's say it's like this and the pen number so let's say i'm using some dummy pen number designation this is senior officer role let's say internal auditor and you have to select the category as well so it should be a loan officer or field officer let's say field officer and set the record another field officer is there 
now let's sign in into the application and see what different different users can perform into the application like if it is an admin user so uh, the most thing uh, the important thing like how you can differentiate that this data like what kind of users you have to fetch from this table so if you notice we have a user category called admin username user loan officer field officer and user so you can differentiate data by this name also and you we have a unique id for the every role so if it is an admin user always uh, role id will be one if it is a user or customer role id will be two similarly three and four let's log in uh, as a first record which is the admin of the application the user id is admin123 and the password is password over there and i hit the sign in button you can check the password from here okay now this after login as an admin i can uh, see that many operations are there so admin have access to uh, like uh, check the customers so if you remember we just recently uh, signed up as a customer and that customer is double and a that is the spelling here so as an admin i have an option to reject this customer or the approve so i just just hit the approve button and record is approved now other option we have a search option by search by me mail or search by name we can search the records okay under the loan officer we have the same operation so admin have access to approve or reject the loan officer uh, officers also in case of if any new loan officer will register or field officer will register into the application the admin can approve or reject them same uh, functionality for the with field officer that we just added so let's say i reject him so that is the status is rejected now okay so loan request if a customer will come into the application and add some uh, request for the loan so all the requests will be displayed here also as admin i can search them by request loan id by name by email id and the approved or reject status okay under the assign background verification bgfo is a background uh, verification for field officer so let's say i want background verification for this the full field officer name is tarik and i'm going to uh, want verification for this number that is done and i clicked on save now if you see the list you will get that uh, that the status is done and it's displaying here also i can edit the record if i want a list of verification background verification is there in case of any uh, issue i can update the status as well so i can check the updated status the status under the background verification update under the assign lbfo lbfo is a loan verification by the field officer so loan verification i can also same i can select the loan officer and i can select the id and click on the save it means it's approved now the status and i can check the updates here here it's a help page if anybody wants any uh, help they will raise a ticket as a customer or officer and all other users so admin can view them here also admin can edit them also admin can, admin can search perform the search operation by issue or by posted id and if i want to add a question as an admin i can add a new question i can check the background uh, like uh, uh, feedback background questions user uh, feedback will be also display here some other common things like my profile change password and logout will be there now as i just sign out with admin user let's log in with another user which is the user or you can say the new customer of the application so i'm going to log in i'm going to log in with a new uh, existing user that i have already have in my database so i just sign in into that and after that i can check the home page i can uh, check the loan requested by me till now so this is my history uh, i can apply for the new loan so let's say i enter the name i enter the phone number and then enter the email id and let's choose a resume and i have to add some data over there like sample image sample image again and uh, i've selected another sample image into the amount the required amount let's say into the 
five nine or something until long tenure long tenure let's say three emi option let's say 12 month address and save the data is saved successfully and applied loan request is done so i can see the newly added loan request and it's the status is showing while processing once the admin will check that request and uh, as admin will update step uh, like approval for the uh, like field officer and loan officer all the status will be updated in the real time here and will display here uh, other section we have a help section help report section and feedback questions so also i can add a feedback and ask questions some crude operations like search and edit update the little video there let's log out as a an user and log in as the last user which is a field officer or a loan officer so as i log in there as an uh, a field officer that is my existing record what i can see all the uh, the users that is assigned to me i can check here under the field officer so you can see some uh, newly uh, users and loan and is assigned to me and i can update or enter verification thing what i have verified there uh, i approved or reject so i can upload some documents if it's there i can click on the save button the data will be saved and that status will send to the admin part uh, admin person and i can check the updates here update re reject or approve same thing same operation with different user uh, can perform by the field officer so i'm going to log in now as a field officer and i will show you to look on that so I can check loan request, background verification, all the same things, but in a different zone. So now, so thank you so much for watching. If you need the source code, just uh, contact us over the WhatsApp, Skype, or email. So the team will be available to configure the project at your machine. So in case of you need any explanation and understanding of the internal code, how the code is working, we have different different services. You can contact us. You can inquiry, and you can.